Procrastination is the thief of time, so let's get rolling. So hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today I am joining Michelle of My Everyday Wife Life, D of D Lovely Life, and doing a dot series, uh, Declutter, Organize, and Clean with Sophia of My Great Challenge. And for my handyman friends, I'm a girl and this is what we do. Leave it at that. So having said that, um, today this I'm going to be cleaning this area. This is where I sit and do work and edit videos and you know basically I, this is the only place I sit down in this house. I don't sit down at the dining room table or in the living room. I just don't. Uh, I don't really have an office if you will. So I just keep everything that I need to, you know, take notes or whatever in the, in these three drawers down here and I'll show you what I'm talking about. I did not put a lazy Susan in the corner of this kitchen. I didn't put in a lazy Susan because, you know, every time I've ever been around people who had one, something would fly off the back and you're doing an archaeological dig to find whatever it was that flew off the back. And I just didn't want one. Drawers hold more. I just reversed the drawer cabinet. And so uh, that's just what I did, you know, to each their own, right? So right now, um, I'm having trouble finding things because everything is just such a mess. Um, uh, you know, my house is under construction, in case you didn't know. It's a slow process with the way things are currently. And um, so it's just one project at a time. And since uh, there's a halt on my last project, which is where the uh, sill for the house broke and it cracked a bunch of joists, um, things have slowed down and now I can take time to actually just declutter and clean up a little bit because I do live in my construction zone. So, I'm gonna quit talking and I'm just gonna to get to it. So let's see what I have here. I'll try to get you in a good position. Um, paperwork that can go in the trash. This, these, this is what I got stuck in my hair. These are fly ribbons. And only Dawn dishwashing liquid gets this stuff out of your hair so if you ever run into one like I did that needs to go inside of a Ziploc bag and oh look what are the odds what I have here are fruit fly problems it's grapefruit season uh, and grapefruits are falling on the ground and they're causing fruit flies to start coming around and they get in the house and they get my Chardonnay, so that kind of hurts me. So these need to go uh, in uh, probably my insect area outside. Batteries, these can stay. Oh look, they can go in a Ziploc bag. I don't know why there's so many Ziploc bags in here. of all the packaging. Very real. Okay. That is trash. Um, lottery ticket I need to check. And my to-do list. Oh, I found my to-do list. Isn't that crazy? Look at all this. Um, that stays. I'm an index card person. I love index cards. They fit in my cell phone case when I make notes or lists. So all of this stays. This is my list. Sharpie pens. I never use this. It's a um, 
coaster so that can go in the donate box i need to clean it more post-it notes it's trash or recycle <clears throat> another battery these go into my simply safe uh, carbon monoxide and, and smoke detector. That's it. Recycle. I need to install this in the apartment. And these are my picture hangers. These are those ooks. And they work pretty good. They don't trash your walls when you hang stuff up, so. Um, this is a nice one, but I don't like the end of the corkscrew. It doesn't set into the corkscrew in, at first, so this is just backup. I could probably, well, I don't know what to do with that. Um, I probably need to return that or either I can't screw it into the doors here inside the house because the doors are very thin. Um, I could probably use that in the apartment when I start working on it. This goes in my camera box. That is full. This is full. Um... I don't know what this goes to, so I think it probably goes to my camcorder. Or my, this goes to my, um, oh, what do you call that? Um, cam trails. Uh, so let's put all that in here. Glue stick, dental floss. This is another ook. something to do with it. Something I sent Sophia. Oh, you see a pattern or a problem here? I've been looking for these nail clippers that goes with my emery boards. Where are they? Here they are. That stays in the front of the drawer. Another chain for ceiling fan. Oh look, more batteries. I just haven't found my hands. That's what I'm really, really looking for. Oh, look, another Ziploc bag. What can I put in it? This is the back to that magnet strip that I have on the refrigerator if I want to mount it to the wall. So that can go into hardware, which is 
hardware. And I don't have a hardware pile. Guess what I do now? Okay. Uh, this is for my fans. Uh, I'm sorry, this is for my lighting for my YouTube channel. It goes into manuals. Oh, I gotta keep these. These are very important. These are to my um, keyless entry door locks. This is my, that's my pipe thread sealant. I need to put that in hardware. This is another, that's my back door keyless entry. And what is this? Uh, that was a background check. That's trash. I already know where that subject lives. What do we have here? Oh, look, more batteries. And this goes to my thermostat in the hallway, which eventually I will be getting the mini splits. Look, another Ziploc bag. Another battery. More index cards. I think these are spent. Uh, more to-do list index card I go to that another receipt that goes with the household expenses tax right off look another ziploc bag that has uh, oh this is the brass pipe I don't know why in the world I kept the, I don't know what that's about, but I do have another Ziploc bag. All right, another. Battery. Another one of those chalk things, chalk magic marker things. Oh look, more index cards. Um. I don't know what this is for. Oh, these are my cabinets that I had to buy off the shelf due to what's floating around. That's trash. I don't even know why I have that. Look, more batteries. More of this fly paper. More Christmas light bulbs and look another Ziploc bag. It's trash. Um oh your Instapot thing. Your cooking timetables. Uh I'll probably keep that. Yeah, I didn't even know I had it. I need to keep it. It stays in here. Uh if I knew. Okay, I think this is a better angle for you.
these are awesome. These are spongy uh, door stops. I put one on the baseboard of where my refrigerator is because when my refrigerator would open, it turned the lights off because I have paddle switches. This is awesome. That's awesome. These are magnets, magnets that I bought for that project that I've changed my mind on. I'm going to get another filler. Remember that hidden cabinet? Um, I'm going to put hinges on another filler and so because it's tearing the shit out of the sides of the chipboard. Some more pads. I bought this off of Amazon. I will leave you a link. And I mean, it is any type of pad, felt pad that you could use for your furniture that you could possibly ever need. So when I had my floors redone, I hope bought a whole box of these things and it's been worth, worth it. Trash. That's me. Uh, my sister, oldest sister, she had just gotten married to this guy, and that's my middle sister, and that's my cousin, Wendy, and this was probably taken in, uh, I'd say the late 80s, no, when did Lori, whenever Lori got married, I don't even remember when that was, I have no idea, that's a keep. Ah, the first sob that I helped restore, brushes for different occasions. And I buy these off Amazon, and I will leave the link in the description. You get your different color of box, or the brushes are different colors for different applications. You guess from like cleaning upholstery or whatever to cleaning grills outside. A great investment. I use it to clean the, the vinyl seats in my truck. And it's just a very good plan. I've got the yellow ones to do the bathrooms. And uh, I got these as well. These are great for cleaning your bathtub. I couldn't get what I wanted yet. Daggum it. All right, behave. All right, that's that. All right. All right, now I can start putting stuff back in. Closing bags, so hang on a second. Let's see what I got down here. Ugh. Wow. Oh no, not more.
Well, since I found my handle, I thought I'd go ahead and put it on. So here's my jig. Set. There. Because on your, you can get this at Home Depot. It comes for the, the doors that are like this, and they come for the drawers. There's two jigs. It was about 20 bucks, if that. And what you do is you take your handle and you find out which one. I've already pre-marked mine. And it comes with its own drill bit. And you just mark, put it, make sure it's level. started I am not a lefty I'm on call well that was a neat little project glad you were here well, I really appreciate you guys being here and for those who do declutter videos on a regular basis my hats off to you because this is not my scene but it had to be done and I thank you D of D lovely life for inspiring me today to actually edit and upload this video um, and Michelle I wish you luck on your decluttering and thank you Sophia for helping me understand exactly a proper declutter so Again, all these three ladies that I mentioned are going to be listed below in the description box. And I thank you again for being here. And if you like this video, please hit the like button. And if you haven't already, please subscribe and hit that bell for future notifications. And, you know, I really appreciate you being here and I'll see you in the next.